The Rapid Equipping Force, a recently institutionalized U.S. Army Training and Doctrine Command organization, harnesses current and emerging technologies to provide immediate solutions to the urgent challenges of U.S. Army forces deployed globally. To do this, the REF works directly with soldiers to support three lines of effort, equip, insert, and assess. The REF equips units with commercial and government off-the-shelf technologies to mitigate urgent capability gaps identified by deployed and pre-deploying units. By giving units the non-standard kit they need to address material shortfalls in 180 days or less, the REF helps soldiers adapt and reduces overall risk. REF supports Army innovation by inserting emerging capabilities or creating new uses for existing designs. This line of effort allows operational units to try potential game-changing solutions and provide real-time feedback. Finally, the REF supports both near-term requirements and future force capabilities by conducting assessments and sharing lessons learned with key Army partner organizations. REF assessments evaluate the systems it has equipped to units, but also address the Army's larger material questions related to operational needs, such as soldier load, traumatic blast effects, and subterranean operations. The REF provides the Army an adaptive and innovative capability through a unique set of authorities that allow it to react quickly to incoming soldier needs. The REF's three core authorities are requirement validation, flexible funding, and acquisition authority. The REF Director has been delegated Requirement Validation Authority by Headquarters Department of the Army, G357. As such, HQDA recognizes the REF 10-liner as an urgent requirements document. REF works directly with units that complete 10-liners, which prompt the requesters for information relating to operational challenges and proposed solutions. This information enables REF to conduct mission analysis on all incoming requirements and helps the director quickly and efficiently make a determination to support or not to support the request. Though the vast majority of its funding comes from Overseas Contingency Operations, or OCO, funds, the REF receives a variety of allocated funds each year to allow it the agility to support units in all phases of war and across the range of operations. Per an agreement with the Army Acquisition Executive, PEO Soldier provides the REF's Milestone Decision Authority and has provided REF with a dedicated project manager. The REF PM manages its acquisition efforts and has the authority to execute Army funds to purchase commercial and government off-the-shelf technologies. Lessons learned from the use of these technologies is shared with the Army Capabilities Integration Center, or ARCIC, at TRADOC. Highly successful solutions can lead to larger equipping actions by the Army. Together, these three unique authorities create the pillars of the REF and illustrate the close partnership among TRADOC, HQDA, and ASALT. Built upon a foundation of senior leader confidence, direct access to deployed soldiers, and a flexible workforce trained in rapid equipping, the REF's core authorities create a highly collaborative organization with the decision authority at the appropriate level, facilitating an increased rate of innovation. By integrating the REF's three key authorities under one roof, the Army created a solution capability to fill urgent requirements of deployed U.S. Army forces. We connect government programs, industry, and academia to provide off-the-shelf technologies for those unexpected challenges and key opportunities. Wherever our soldiers deploy, the rest stands ready to support them to win. The Commanding General of TRADOC, REF's higher headquarters, has made it clear that the REF is for increasing the rate of innovation so the United States Army will always be in a position of advantage. Therefore, REF is focused on challenges faced by units in the field, at the brigade level and below, and across all seven Army functional concepts. REF projects address the capability shortfalls of deployed units in areas such as Mission Command, Movement and Maneuver, Intelligence, Fires, sustainment, engagement, and maneuver support and protection. I'm Sergeant First Class Sam Bright. I've been in the Army for 20 years. I've deployed five times, and I've been with the REF for two years. As a leader in the Army, my number one mission is the welfare of the soldier. Working at the REF allows me to help warfighters by listening to their issues, identifying the capability gaps, and figuring out a viable solution to fill those gaps. It's very gratifying to know that a soldier can walk into the REF with a challenge and walk away with a solution. 
If you are a deployed or deploying soldier or commander with a material challenge, or if you have an emerging technology solution and would like to speak with a REF Technology Scout, please contact the REF Operations Center. Visit our website at www.ref.army.mil to learn more. Victory starts here.